Eh? I didn't even know anything like this happened. You know, if I had known, I would have been here long, long, long time ago. Eh? Please, just take heart. Oh? It's okay. Thank you very much. Hi. Let me go and get something. Ah, no, 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 no. Sit down, sit down. No, I don't want to take anything. In fact, I am not even in the mood to take anything. Eh? Don't worry. It's okay. Eh? I don't know why good people don't last. Why? That evil thing that killed your husband should have come to my house to, to, to carry somebody away. Don't talk like that. I mean it, oh. I mean it. Wait, oh. You think if my husband dies today, me, I will cry for him. God forbid that thing. I will never do it. That man is too foolish for my liking. In fact, it was my mother who was equally foolish to have pushed me into marrying that old stupid man. Eh? Just because of one rickety car he was pulling at that time. Now look at me. Just imagine. But wait, let me ask you, was there ever a time you loved him before marrying him? Did I ever love him? I don't even know what I was doing with him. In fact, that man emptied something into my food. That is the only explanation. <laughs> something like what? Huh? All these bad old men in the village. You know what they can do now? <laughs> oh, Julia, stop it. But I beg, take heart. I didn't know. Okay. Hey. Thanks for everything. That was great. Brother, on a no serious note, okay. you have to do something. Your wife is like a useless machine that cannot do more than making noise. When you married her, she came in with that child you called Junior. If I may ask, who's Junior? Uh, what, what do you mean? Yes, who's Junior? Does it really sound reasonable to you that you're calling another man's child Junior? Um, Angela, you know that in our culture, mm -hmm. when a man marries a lady with an illegitimate child, that child becomes the man's mm -hmm. own. <laughs> No, tell me. Brother, forget culture. A child is not yours if it is not yours. Open your eyes wide. This woman is using you to give her son an inheritance where he should not have it. I might get ready to marry a fertile woman, child. That's all right. Stop marketing. Me. Marketing. What, did I say anything wrong? This is the way you always talk. Anytime I raise this issue. Angela, what have I said wrong now? I said okay. don't stop marketing. I am going. Stop marketing. I'm going back to my house. Angela. I am marketing. I, Angela, come back here. Uh, Angela. I said. What is wrong with this with me? Huh? Julia Fire. Angela Fire. Are you pretending as if you're deaf, Joshua? I said I've missed my period for the second month. Why did you miss it? Did I ask you to go and miss any period? You know what I mean, Joshua. I refuse to know what you mean. Okay. Let me tell you. I am pregnant for you. Yeah. <laughs> Clap for her, people. <laughs> you think I don't know your tricks? I know all your tricks. You want money from me, and you want to use pregnancy as an excuse to extort money from me. Come on, tell me something better. Wait, wait, wait. You think I want to terminate this pregnancy? I am sorry to disappoint you, Joshua, because I am keeping it. Besides, I need money to start taking care of this baby. You need money, yet you don't need money. Come on, young lady. Which one do I follow? Follow the both of them. What I need is money to start taking care of your baby. At least I have to register for antenatal and other things. Young woman, go and look for the man who made you pregnant. Eh? Go and look for the person who made you pregnant and don't come close to me after this. <laughs> <laughs> 
Ici, Guinée. Comme ma quête, je suis avec Guinée, please. Hein? Ok. Don't worry, you come back. We should set out to arrange for it, okay? I don't need the house help. I can take care of my daughter. Like your husband said, God is there for us. Fair enough, okay. Um, if you're gonna take care of her, or if you ever you change your mind about the house help, it's no problem. Just know that whatever we have belongs to you as well. All right? So, um, I just want me to see a friend down the road. You need to come out, see people, people will see you. You know, that way you, you release a lot of things from your mind. Hi, I'm, hey God, I'm glad though, I'm very glad. Hey, how is our daughter? How is she? She's fine, I just took her to my sister's house. Ah, yeah. I'm never going from here, I'm just becoming happy. Thank God though, at least the worst is over. So you're back? Yes, I am. Yeah. This one you're smiling, it'd be like say you grant somewhere. No, you're welcome, please, sir. Thank you, sir. Come, why did you do this, sir? What do you You said good afternoon, sir. Don't you know that now that you've called him, sir, his head will start swelling to high heavens. And me, I am not ready to call him any such thing. Wait, do you hate him that much? It is not a matter of hate. Don't you know that if you call him, sir, today, Tomorrow he wants you to call him chief. Anyway, just give me one minute. Huh? I'm coming back. Why were you looking at that woman like that? Eh? Why were you looking at that woman like that? At least I saw the way your eyes were just roaming all over her body like a he goat. Sophia, are you not ashamed of yourself? Julia, I think that that your madness has... Oh, will you shut up? You need to go shut down. Shut up. Silent. Just answer me now. Answer me now so that I will know what to do to you. Wait, oh. Did you look at that woman's dress? Did you see her black dress? It's horrible. I know you need drugs. But at least, did you not suggest something to you? That woman is mourning her dead husband. So if you like, go and incur the anger of a dead man. To fear! Not just stick me. Get out! I feel your mind. Uh, excuse me. Next time you see me at a woman anywhere, mm. just make yourself scarce. Don't even come near that place. Because if you do, hey, try and curb your appetite for the female gender. You are not the only man on earth. To fear! You feel them, me. You feel like them, me. I got the appetite. I told you, you are an empty cattle. You're not of are empty cartons used. They are used in hey. carrying rubbish. So yeah. you are an empty carton. Get out. You don't carry on a Shut up. Rubbish. Rubbish, rubbish you are. Idiot. Ah, me. Oh, my God. 
I was just attempting to add important family issue inside. Not to worry. I'm getting ready to go. Ah, ah. Now, now. You just came. I know. Ha. Okay, this one you say you don't want me to give you anything. Why not take something? Even if it's even if it's a, a, a soft drink. Hmm? It's okay. Thank okay, you. Gala. <laughs> Ginger. <laughs> Wait. Uh, Gavin. Okay. Wait. <laughs> Granot, I have everything now. Yes, thank you. Just whatever you have. Okay. No problem. Just uh, greet your husband for me. Hey, will you make him now? What did I just say? Sorry. It was a sleep of strong. No, it's okay, please. Just greet your daughter for me. Eh? Okay, no, no, no. This is a lot. You know that, too, as well. Alright, take care of yourself. Bro. Yes, I am. I, you see, I've been trying for some time now to reach any member of his family. I hope there's no problem. I hope you won't be offended if I tell you this. Go ahead. I'm Joshua's girlfriend. Mm -hmm. He got me pregnant and he has not accepted responsibilities. You mean you're pregnant for my brother? <laughs> hey! Never disappoint me. Why are you rejoicing? You will not understand. Are you sure my brother hmm, is responsible for this pregnancy? Yes, he is. When I told him, all he did was walk away. Why don't you want to go away with him? Like other girls. You see. I want to keep it. Mm. If a woman is not lucky enough to have a husband, she should at least have a child. I'm talking about single parenthood. Ah. Mm. Okay. Don't worry. Mm? We shall go and see him. Mm? Don't worry. Thank Don't you. worry. <laughs> eh? It is work. Mm? Okay. Thank you. Let me do it. Hey! Joshua, my brother, like heavy things. Heavy, heavy! Eh? It's not easy to convince an elephant to lie down. Okay. Give me three minutes. I'm coming. Let me change. Eh? Okay. We're going right away. Thank God what is really happening to me and my family. Miscarriage upon miscarriage. What becomes of our lineage? My late brother's wife has a female child. And mine? Miscarriage for three consecutive times? What becomes the fate of my family if something should happen to me? I will discuss it with Mary first, and if she sees reason with me, then I will know how to sell this idea to my wife. Joshua, you have not answered me. What do you want me to answer now? Huh? Do you know this lady here? This lady? Yes. Who is she? Joshua, are you denying me or something? Do you mean you no longer know me? Are you saying that you don't know her? Or you are just trying to play hide and seek? See me, see trouble. Eh? Angela, when did you start to question me like this? If you know where you brought this lady, take her back to that place. Period. Huh. 
This thing you're doing will not help you, Joshua. When you used to come for weekend, you were enjoying it. Now that the fruit of your labor is germinating, you're denying it. It's not fair. If you if anyone, if I discover that my brother did not make you pregnant and that you're just taking advantage of him, <laughs> eh, you know we like waiting I will show you. He knows I'm not lying. Now so the other woman just planned here with her own child, all in the name of marriage, imposing responsibilities on my brother. Now you don't land with your own. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Joshua, will you swear by any deity or anything you value so much that you did not make love to me sometime without protection? When I was asking you to cover up, what did you say? Listen, young lady. You can't get me. Do you hear me? Go and tell the people that sent you that you did not see me. Am I clear? Well, for your information, the last time I went for ultrasound, I was told the baby is kicking fine and that I need male variation test and to take some rest. Joshua, I need money to take care of your son. Son? Yes. Did you just say son? So, the ultrasound people have confirmed that the baby is a son. Ah, Joshua. Stop denying. You're responsible. Hey, <laughs> this one that I have seen. Joshua, you're responsible. Well, Angela, thank you very much for your effort. Hmm? Yes. And to you, Joshua, I'm leaving. I will take care of the responsibility myself. My own way. Thank you for the treatment. Joshua, for the last time, tell me the truth. Are you responsible for her pregnancy? Angela, what news now? <laughs> huh? Hey, if you are, that means your wife is infertile and you're potent. <laughs> Joshua, talk to me. Talk to me before I push it. Talk Angela, to me. Angela, leave me. Leave me now. What's your trouble? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you are in your trouble. Okay. We are talking of something important. We are talking about news. Feiwa is making trouble. I know her plans. She wants me to marry her. I hate polygamy. Hey God, what do I do now? Help me. <sighs> Joshua, what is your problem? Hmm? This is the second time you're sitting up to think. What is it? Close your eyes and sleep. Eh? Hey, why you open your own and think? Don't be later now. Una go begin talk say I no fit carry belly. Oh yeah, can't do what a man they do before woman carry belly. You no fit do. Oh, this is midnight. Shut up, shut up. Which midnight? No before midnight people they carry belly. Can't do something no. Can't do something now. See, Joshua, can't do something before I lose my temper. What is wrong with you? Oh yeah, come and do something. Ah. Come and do something. Yeah. What is wrong with you? What? Come and do something. Yeah. Come. Yeah. Come and do something. Where are you going? Come, come here. Come, come and do something. You want to rape me? Cheers. Do you want to rape me? There is no real passion against me that is going to get work. away. Get away. In fact, I'm leaving this room for you. Look at this one. Come leave. I, I'm leaving this room for you. Nonsense. Mm -hmm. You're not even happy that I'm even asking you to come and do something. Idiot. You think say after I'm going to make you do, 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 do your head. I'm okay. I just want to make you come out for this bed. Idiot. Come sleep. Make I see. <sighs> Yes. 
my sister. No, she's fine. She's uh, recovering. She's doing well. She and the girl, they're fine. I mean, she's getting over the shock. Maybe you should stop going there regularly. Why would you say that? I wouldn't want anything to start happening. Well, like what? What exactly do you mean? You know what I mean. No, I don't know what you mean. She can begin to develop interest in you and... How can I start dating my late brother's wife? What you're saying is nonsense. I'm not talking nonsense. Yes, you are. You know he met her before me. So? Now that I have started to visit her regularly in the presence that you're taking care of your late brother's wife, Satan can whisper something to you and you practice it. That's nonsense. Do you, do you, do you want to leave this house? You can go back to my sister's house and rest. Look, I don't understand what you're driving at. The flesh is the weakest part of the human body. You may be tempted to start looking at my husband somehow. Wait, are you suspecting something you're not sure of, Gora? No. All I'm saying is that you can start getting close to a man somewhere if you're feeling lonely. My husband has begun to spend so much time in your house and I'm not comfortable with that arrangement. Get up and leave my house. What did you just say? You heard me. I said, get up and leave my house. I did not speak evil. He heard me wrong. So, what I'm suspecting is true if not. Why are you angry? I will go. But listen, I will show you something your eyes cannot be heard. Just get out. Story. Just get suspect us. Who cares? You know, it's it's I've always known both of you together anyway. And 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 I was supposed to marry you because I love you. It's you that have been in my heart. So I mean let what happen let it happen. This can't just be. Do you know the gravity of what you're plunging into? People can even say that you killed your brother just to take over his wife. Let them say what they want to say. I don't care. Because God knows the truth. He knows I didn't do it. I didn't do anything. I mean, you can conceive. She cannot. You understand me? So let them say whatever they want to say. Tell me, tell me, what reason don't I have to want to be with you? Tell me. Please don't trouble me. It's got kind of Just allow me to think it's okay. My head is right. Fine. I will give you some thinking space. Just know that I'm serious. I am serious. Give it some thought. Alright? I don't know. And if I don't, what will happen? 
Hmm? This is what will happen to you. You slapped me. Yes, I did. Your own act of God will punish you severely if you don't kill me here today. God will punish you. You have to kill me today. God will punish you. You have to kill me today. God will punish you. See Obama, American president, say it. Obama. American president. Yes! I love you. Wait, wait, wait. Let me show you. Okay, just show me. How dare you barge into my house without me? Now listen, I've come to issue a final warning. Stay away from my husband. Because the next time I come here, I will put this bullet into this empty head of yours. Please, just put it down, please. Just put it down. This is just a warning. Stay the hell away from my husband. She said Martha came to threaten her in her house with a gun. Wonderful! What happened? She was weeping all through, so I couldn't hear her well. Mommy, they've been having problems between them recently. So you know that they have been having problems recently and you didn't care to tell us? I thought they were going to resolve it. So what's the problem? Sister Martha has been complaining that her husband spends a lot of time in Sister Mary's house since the burial of Mary's husband. She suspects they are having an affair. Hmm. Affair? Who told you that? I think the whole thing is worsened by the fact that Sister Mata has no child yet. So is Chima planning to marry the two sisters? Papa, uh -huh. I must rush to Lagos. I know my two daughters. I know both of them very well, and I know the kind of temper they have. I'll go with you. Okay, Chima. Get me Chima's number. It, I don't have my glasses around, eh? Ah, what yes, type of... Thank you very much. What type of problem is this? Is the rumor I'm hearing true? What rumor? That uh, Sister Mata's husband is making advances towards Sister Mary. <laughs> That's all. Everything can be true now. And that... Sister Martha went to Sister Mary's house and threatened her with a gun. Daddy, what is going on? I have to go to Lagos. No, you are not going anywhere. I will go and see our in-laws, I mean Chima's uncles. When I come back, then we will decide who is going to Lagos. Probably your mother will go. Hmm? If you say so, Daddy. That's what I said. I think something has to be done. It's getting out of hand. Brother, what I'm saying is this. If you think you want baby, it's a boy. Then run after her. Marry her and be sure that you have a child of your own. Your own flesh and blood. Not that one that you call Junior. Who's Junior? Is it possible to make a photocopy without the original? No. But you know, I don't like polygamy. You know, I don't like it. Eh? Those men that marry more than one wife, they don't do it because they like it. They do so because of circumstances beyond their control. Then what happens to my wife? 
She can go to hell for all I care. No, 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 no. Don't talk like that. It's not fair. But it is fair for another man's child to be calling you daddy. Listen, whether you like it or not, I am going to tell if anyone that you have accepted her. Eh? Yes. You will do what? If Julia has blindfolded you, she will never and will never blindfold me. It's not like that, Angela. It's not like that. Then it's like what? Okay. So you have to check. Uh, well, it's your letter. Dear sister, by the time you'll be reading this note, I should be relaxed in a faraway country with Chima, my love. Do not weep at all. This is my chance. I'm traveling with him and my daughter, Angel. Do not bother looking for us. Do not. Bye forever. Jesus Christ. What has come over at that time now? What has come over? Why did this children want to kill me now? Where has she gone to? Sister, let's go inside. We have to sit down and talk about this. Okay. Mommy, I'm finished. Finish with me. Please, let's go inside. Oh, my God. What have I done now? Hey! What have I done now? What have I done Are you sure she started dating your husband after her husband was buried? Yes. By all indications. I just want to make sure nobody's hallucinating here. Are you sure he was not going there to oversee his late brother's family? Which, of course, is his civic duty in the absence of a father and another brother. Martha. Mommy. Did you by any means threaten your sister with a gun? Yes. Ah. When I had it up to my neck, hey. I went that far. Ah. I guess you got it wrong. You went too far. Too wrong. Too, too wrong. Now you have scared them away. Eh? You scared her away. Mommy, I couldn't believe that my twin sister could do such a thing to me. Is it because I couldn't bear him a child? Now on mere grounds of suspicion, you nearly took her life, all in the name of protecting your marriage. Do you know that certain careful dispositions end up in careless exposition? Do you know? Now tell me, who is wrong? You have chased her away, oh my God, with your husband and her daughter. You see, you have succeeded in creating the same problem you are trying to avoid. Hi! Hey. Mommy, what do I do? Oh. This morning is too heavy for my neck. You caused all this. You just caused all this. No, 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 no. This is not time to apportion blame. It is no longer what do I do now. It is what do we do now. All hands have to be on deck. Look at it. They are gone. No trace. We still have to work hard and when I get back, I will discuss with your father. We just have to pray. What are we going to do? Hmm. Now 
I beg, help me tell that woman, say I did it. Is she talking to me? Yeah. Who are you greeting? <laughs> when did you learn how to greet? You've taught me. Well, that shall never end though. Please, it's my brother here. Do I look like your brother's keeper? Eh? Anyway. I can see his car is not here. Whoa, I don't but I want you to help me, eh? Tell him that we have concluded arrangement to go to his new wife. I mean, the new girl he wants to marry. What kind of message is this? Julia, are you with me? Wait, oh. You people are planning to get him another wife, okay? Yes. Okay, oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that is very good. Eh, but wait. That new wife. Where is she going to stay? Are you planning to bring her into this house? Or are you people still planning to get her another house? For your information, Julie. Or Juliana. I don't know what they're calling you. The girl in question is already pregnant for my brother. <laughs> At least this one, eh? It's his own flesh and blood, our blood. All oh, that bastard you call Junior. Hmm? <laughs> you want to give me inheritance in our family? It will not work for you, Omar Regi. Eh? But I have one good advice for you. Julie, just begin now to pack your things. Eh? Clean up. Clean up your past. I'm going, you know, because I know, say, you don't get my message, eh? Madam, bye bye, eh? Come on. Is that woman really your husband's sister? Eh? <laughs> this woman fit me this thing. She don't mean nothing. Leave that thing, I beg. This woman fit me this thing. Ha! Ha! She don't mean anything. Ah, she talk crazy. Eh? So, oh, oh, oh. You go sit down for here. Another woman go walk her, enter your husband's house. Come sit down. Do you want iron better? Eh? She fit me in this thing. She don't mean anything, I beg. Ah, do your hair, more go inside, please. Hmm. You see the worry? Ah, she don't mean anything. Leave that thing. Ah, leave her. For her own good. I just hope she doesn't mean this nonsense. She just told me now. <laughs> Correct. You are right there. Ah. Mm. Come, oh, come. Talk to me. Talk to me before before Heavenly Thought that separates this your big head from your stupid neck. Uh, what is it? Wait, so you wanted to marry that girl into this house, Abby? And you think I'll just sit here and fold my hands and let it happen up there? Never! It won't happen. Not in this house! It can't happen! What's wrong with you? Get out! Go, go and sit down! You are, let me tell you, you are nothing but a carton. And an empty carton at that. Get yeah. away from here! Look at me. you stopping where I'm, where I'm eating. Me? I am not a carton. Of course you are. Yeah. Come here! Who is a carton? Julia! Who is a carton? I am not a carton! Hey, yeah. Julia! Julia! If you don't leave me here... Yeah, I... What will you do? Come on, mama, boy. What will you do? She... I will, I, will, I will disorganize you. Okay, okay, okay. Your lips will be no pieces sense. now. See, eh? You and that stupid girl will regret it. You will regret it! Your sister was even bragging that she's already pregnant for you. Come on. Where did you start giving people pregnancy? How, how did you even do it? You! I will deal with you, then tell that your girl I will deal with her as well. There is you, nothing you will see. Julia, come. What do you think? Tell me, what do you think you can do? Get out! Tell me what empty cattle. Get away there. Come into the store what I'm eating. What is it? Julia, bring that food here. Whoa, my. Bring that food. Go to her and give me food. If you go with this food there, this is the last food you are going to eat in this house. Ah, you, you're on your way to bed. Come on. I'm going to walk your mom. Come on, eat. Give me my food. Bring, bring it. Don't worry. Hmm? We shall marry you. 
No shaking at all at all. As long as I dare your side. You hear me? Even if you don't get a better character. Uh, don't worry, we will manage you. Mm. Then we will let her correct the character. You hear me? <laughs> <laughs> but I know she also get better character. Sure. Cool down first. Might tell you this. Mm. If you see fruit, chop her. You see fish, see vegetable. Carry go. Anything mm. we will make this body for mm. Eh? Mm. We go give food for this picking. Mm. Mm. Carry go. I get behind you. Uh, yeah. yeah. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now go ahead, so. Okay, oh, thank you, eh? Ah. Bye bye. Which one? Bye bye. Oh, you get off. Come see me off. You know, no say SI is very good for pregnant woman. No, no, no. Hey, Omo, you there here? Angela, where did you disappear? I've been waiting here for you all this time. Where did you disappear to? Well, I'm sorry. I went to see an important person down the road. Okay, let's go inside. Mm -hmm. Let's stay here and talk. Angela, my house has been on fire. Big fire since yesterday. Oh. It's no news. Your house has always been on fire. Did she beat you this time around? Angela, why did you go to tell my wife that I intend to marry Ife Yuma? When I have not made up my mind, why did you do that now? You better start making up your mind. Uh, uh. There was chaos in my house yesterday. That's what I'm telling you. Mm. She was only her mouth. She threatened to deal with us. She, come, why did you tell her that if anyone is pregnant? Why? <laughs> That's where you spoiled the whole matter. Eh, I did so to wash down her impetus. Your wife does not fear anyone who is not a tiger. Hey. Listen. You had better start to go and apologize to Ife Inwa. Tell her that you are sorry for denying her in the first place. Then, uh, after that? Marriage, of course. When we marry her, rent an apartment for her elsewhere to avoid trouble. Then I'll be running two homes simultaneously. That's your arrangement now. Okay, huh? if you don't want to run two homes. Marry her and bring her into your home and run one. This is, this is, this is trouble. Confusion written in capital letters. <laughs> I don't like this arrangement. <laughs> look at, look at his face. Are you laughing? Look at my brother's face. I see. Anyway, let me not talk before he starts that day. Is that all? Wait, I want to go inside my house. Ah. You and this your Julia. Julia. Every time. You don't want to come inside. I'm, I'm going, I'm going. I'm going. Ah. <laughs> Ife, please, forgive me, I beg you. I was denied because I thought you would remove the pregnancy. I beg, forgive me. Why will I remove the pregnancy? Eh? How many children do we have in my father's house? Why will I remove the one that God has given me, even if his father denies him? Please forgive me. Please, won't you forgive me? See, I want to marry you now. <laughs> For real. Oh. Are you speaking your voice or that of your sister? Uh, both. Joshua, you can go now, eh? Give me time, let me think about this. Eh? As you can see my condition right now, I'm not supposed to be talking too much. So please. That's all right. Thank you very much. What are you? Shh! 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 She has killed my husband. She has killed him. Oh God, Julia, don't say what you are not sure of. Don't say what you are not sure of. How could she have planned it and caused herself at the venue of the operation? You don't know that woman. I know she can do it. <laughs> hey, God. Wait, oh. Are you saying I am now a widow? 
I am not a widow. I am not a widow. I am not a widow. The woman is in the ICU ward of the general hospital. She was forced into love. Hi. I can't even tell if she has delivered of the baby. Which baby? Which baby? Let her come and deliver. She will die there. That woman, she must die there. She has killed her husband. Shut up. You she must die. You idiot. You shameless mosquito that beat my brother to death. Is it not because of the too much trouble that you gave my brother that I made him to start looking for another woman? Will you shut you. up? Will you shut up, you big you. fat king of a I will crush you in this house. If you don't, you don't, don't shut up, I will just shut up. Shut up! 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 Shut Hello? Hello? Yes, it's me. You were paid to do a clean job, which you said you did. Don't even argue with me, just shut up. The woman is still alive. Instead, you kill the man. Will you shut up there? The woman is the reason you were sent there. And right now, she's at the hospital trying to give birth to a premature baby whom I'm very sure they're going to preserve in an incubator. Are you stupid? Hello? Are you Mrs. Julia Joshua, the wife to Lady Joshua, who was shot in a woman's house? <laughs> must you remind me? Pretend. Eh? Must you remind me of the sad event? <laughs> yes. He was my husband. Can you imagine? They just went there and shot him for me. They just killed him for me. Shut up, madam. Two of the assassins have been arrested. They confessed that you sent them to kill the pregnant woman. Who? Me? Unfortunately, your husband was killed. Julia! Mia! I didn't do anything like that. Julia! This must be a handbook. You! It's you! It's you! Julia, that's how you be! Huh? Huh? Wait, it's not like that I can explain. I can explain. I I just... In fact, I don't even know what they're talking about. Me! Kill my husband. For what now? I was there. 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 I will make sure you pay for this. I will make sure you pay for this. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. How does it feel when a woman is pregnant? Mm, it feels like waiting for your own time and praying for the right man. Uh, uh, is there anything wrong with my question? Is there anything so. wrong with my question? It feels normal to be pregnant. Just normal. So, like, when you stand up, do you feel the weight? So, what if, if the baby is kicking, is it painful? No, it's rather funny. Ha! <laughs> May I feel like getting pregnant though? It's not difficult now. Oh, no problem. There are men loitering all over the place. Just grab one, <laughs> then beg him to help you. <laughs> Why are you talking like this? I'm talking about marriage. Uh, not a girl. Huh. If I get married, I'll be tie rapper like mommy. Huh. Me, I don't like all those kaftan and skirts. If you see a married woman wear skirts, hey, her belly will just make the shape of the skirt useless. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Has anybody heard from my twin sister? No. Oh God. 
Will I ever see her again? What did they wrong, son? I feel incomplete not seeing my two sisters. <coughs> Please, don't just start this your cry now. I don't want to see those tears. Mother has been worried. She has been itching to see her twin sister. Why is she worried? When she went and threatened her twin sister with a gun, what was she expecting? This is not time to cast blames. Huh? This is time to think about way forward. How do we think forward? No one knows where Mary and she ran to. No phone calls. No information. Nothing whatsoever. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> my enemies will finish me with their mouth. They will say that my daughters have been switching husbands and committing adultery, atrocious adultery in her places. Mary should have thought about this. Lower your voice. Hmm? Lower your voice. This is a private discussion between you and I. We should be talking about how to help Martha until she puts to bed. And then hey! continue waiting for her. <laughs> To ever hurt you, you're part of my life. I don't have any other sister like you. My soul is broken, cause I lost everything. Now I'm losing you. I want to become a medical doctor. What? Yes. Since when did you start to nurse that that ambition? Was that what we agreed upon when we were much younger? Didn't we agree to read journalism? Somehow I'm taking interest in medicine. You better drop that interest. We agreed that we're going to become journalists and marry twins like us, or at least two brothers.
to stop sorrowing, face the future, and make sure that the boy is given a thorough upbringing. Did you hear me? Angela, I must thank you for standing by me all through the moment of trial. You see, I will forever miss your brother. As for that Jezebel called Julia, I will make sure she rots in jail. No one touches my trigger without hearing the sound of a bullet. Yes, come in. You again? What have you come to do here? Have you come to spy for her? Have you come to gossip? Now, go. Please. please. I've, I've not come for any of the two, please. I've, I've only come here to clarify myself. I, you see, I, I never knew my friend Julia could do such wicked things, you know, and, and sometimes I quarrel with her over her careless behavior. It's okay, it's okay. Why not just sit down? Thank you. Stand up, stand up. Delete yourself. I don't trust you one bit. A friend of a kite. Please, I have only, I've only come to uh, Thank you, thank you. You have, you have clarified yourself. Go, 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 go. go. They come in the pretense of clarifying themselves. And before you know it, they will add something in your baby's food. You have to be very, very careful. Don't ever allow this woman into this house again. She only came here to spy for her friend. Mama, 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 is 
this what God can do? Hey, you mean? Is that my ah, is that my mamma? It's true. <laughs> we now have two mamma in the house. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but the one we know is the newest mamma. Uh. No problem. I consider it to her. Eh? I don't have all that too for her. Eh, please go and check if my twin children are awake. Yes, mommy. What is wonderful? Well, <laughs> <laughs> God is wonderful. Love me, sir. Love me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. you didn't ask him who brought it. He lent her with her. Dear in-law, how are you and everybody? I hope fine. Well, we want to use this medium to apologize to every member of the family. We are sorry for all that happened. Please, may all of you find a space in your to pardon us. You can reach us with this number. They even included the... And they wrote a letter. Hey, thank you, Jesus. Sorry, I don't talk. Oh my God. Oh my God. We are going to celebrate this reunion. Oh my God. Anything can happen. You are coming. Everything. Don't just come with your fabric. I now have children. They can cook for me. Oh. Yes. Oh. Eh? Mm. Okay, can cook. And Madam of the house. Oh. <laughs> Hey, this is good. So for that letter. But you press it. Yes. Thank you. 